So starting an ER model isn't as easy as you may think it is, right? You may just think that you can just find a random girl, click generate and start promoting and selling content, right? But it's not actually that easy. And with more people coming into the business, it's getting more saturated and more hard to actually get off the ground and start making money with ER models. So I'm going to go over a few facts what you should actually know about starting AI models before you actually do start to give you the best chance of actually standing out and succeeding with this business model. So the first thing you must understand about this business model is that it's not just a shiny object syndrome what's made to get you rich quick, right? It's an actual business model what's going to take time, you're going to have to learn it, you're going to have to suffer. It's a business model, right? That's the one thing you must learn, right? I've seen many people come and go, they've went in the business, joined my Telegram, they're all hyped up to start this shiny object syndrome model, right? Just to realize two weeks later how hard and how difficult, difficult it actually is to get set up and started. In the way you need to think of this business model is, right, is you've got to think of it as kind of like a hobby or a game, right? The more you're learning, the more excited you are, the more chance you are of succeeding, right? So if I want to give any advice to you out there, right, it's to learn the hardest platforms possible of starting an AI model, like the highest generation possible, because that means you're happy, right? If you saw so the main app's called Comfy UI, that's the best of the best. It's open source. You can generate more or less anything on it, right? But if you're constantly using that every single day and you're learning, it makes you happy when you've really a new stage right in business you've got to like kind of set goals for yourself and like figure out like oh if i get to this stage i'll be happy right you've got to set mini goals so maybe your first mini goal is to create a decent looking model right decent quality whatever it is right then your next one might be how to make decent nsfw right and when you reach these small goals it's actually going to keep you going because it, it's like a game you're like trying to reach the next object and it's going to keep you moving forward instead of picking the lowest quality model possible like the lowest quality generation and just thinking oh well this isn't working out it's not going to work like that so another thing is this business model is actually getting saturated very fucking quickly and that's because of shiny object syndrome everyone's going to come in here and be like oh it's going to be a walk in the park i'm going to make 10k a month through ai models but it's not going to be like that right but my point is with the saturation comes a shit ton of competition which means you have to be the best of the best you need to be constantly learning constantly evolving and getting the best quality model out there possible right all my points kind of lead into quality so far right like, if you have the highest quality possible, that means your competition is non-existent, right? Because you have the highest quality. I guarantee you, a lot of the people coming into this business before they start are just going to whip up Genfluence, Picasso, some other online generator, and they're going to be like, oh, yeah, that, that looks class, that. And they're going to realize in two weeks' time that the model looks shit. It's not getting any traction because it looks shit, and they're not making any sales because it looks shit, right? Your competition is going to automatically eliminate themselves, while if you have the highest quality, you're already above your competition, and you're going to be happy because you've made a good amount of progress. Like this business model is all about learning, right? Every business model is about learning, but this one you have to learn a shit ton, whether it's from AI generation, marketing, chatting, optimization of your funnel. You've got to learn all this stuff, and that's kind of like a hard process. Like even the marketing is very hard to learn because you may think, oh, well, I can just post a few videos on Instagram and hopefully one will go viral, right? There's actually reasons videos go viral on, on social medias, and it's simply because the content quality is good and people want to actually f look at that content. So if you don't have content what's desirable and people actually want to watch it, then of course you're not going to go viral, which means you're going to fail at this business model. So you must be learning 24 7 to outrun your competition, make sure you're going viral, make sure you're bringing subs in, and all of these other things, right? Just constantly learning. If you are enjoying the video so far, please make sure to subscribe and like it would mean the world to me. Also, there's a free telegram in the description. It's all about EI OFM and NOL OFM and it's completely free. It's almost got two key members in, so make sure to go join that for some free info. And finally, like any other business model, right, it's going to take time to actually get in place, kick off and make you a bunch of money, right? And I know a lot of you out there don't have the patience for that because it is shiny object syndrome, like I said at the start of the video. But it's a business, right? You've got to give it a time. You've got to give it a chance, right? If, if you want to make three, five, ten key a month, it's not just going to happen like that because you uploaded a few videos on Instagram. You're going to have to learn the process. You're going to have to suffer. You're going to have to get the best quality. You're going to have to learn how to market. You're going to have to do all this or you just don't really have a good chance at succeeding, right? You've just got to play the long game and understand that when you're building something what's actually good and worth it, it's going to take a long, long time. Other than that, I hope this video has given you some insights of what it's actually like to run an ER model please subscribe it will mean the world to me and don't forget to join the ER telegram it's completely free I've got nothing to sell you see ya